our new 2023 president, Jennifer Rodriguez. Woo! So before, before I let her say anything, I have to say, so there used to be this tradition of handing down this big gavel, right, from president to president. And somewhere with COVID, poor Derica, she had it, left it in her office. <laughs> so it got stuck in, you know, when Chase closed down. And then, sorry, how much she cares about me, she only found the stick. And so <laughs> I didn't get anything. And so then I was thinking, like, okay, well, what am I going to pass down? So. First, let me say, I'm extremely, I'm so happy that you're moving into this role. I think you're going to do great things, and I'm so excited um, to be part of that and to see all that the change and things that you're going to progress in CRC. But with that, I was thinking, well, what, what symbolizes CRC? You know, you heard me, I mentioned I was play Giant Jenga, but I don't think we have Giant Jenga today here. So, um, but the ringing of the bells, trying to corral everybody in, all, some of those things. And so I was in Switzerland a couple weeks ago for work and thinking about global mobility and what can I get that represents global mobility and CRC. So this is, hopefully we'll start a new tradition, but this is the past down. So we'll go, go, yeah, go ahead and open it, yes. I'm nervous, it makes me fly out. <laughs>
the world worked in the way that it did because I have found something that I'm so extremely passionate about and I can't wait to really make an impact in this industry and help young professionals um, have a voice in this industry as well. So it was a challenge, but it was a good one. Also, for any football fans or 49er fans, Jimmy Garoppolo and I do have a photo together <laughs> and I can show it to you, so let me know if you want to see it. Um, sorry, I'm going off my phone. Millennials, right? All right. Um, anyways, and here's me, paper typed up. <laughs> um, so in 2022, you know, I've spent a lot of time reflecting on the past year um, for quite some time, and I think 2022, you know, it was our first year being back full swing, and meetings in person. Everyone's getting back on their feet blisters, you know, the whole thing. So um, as I look back at the past year, I think as Betsy mentioned too, that her her MO for 2022 was change. Um, and I wanna give hats off to our 22, 2022 board of directors for navigating a lot of changes and challenges that 2022 had presented. Um, and you know, being a young, or young professional, um, I want to embrace change. I think that's important. I think change fuels our industry. And these are all good things, or not always good, but for the most part, they'll have a good impact. Um, so now I sit here and I've, I've um, spent a lot of time as well thinking about the next 12 months. And where do I want to make my mark? What do I want to do? How can I make CRC move the needle? What are things that are gonna make this organization stand out? What are all these things that we can do to bring to the forefront and have you know outside members that maybe not be part of Chicago, but that want to be part of CRC? How can we do that? And this is something that you know I'm really excited to include with our um, new leadership team. I can't wait to sit down and talk about these ideas and also hear what they have to say because that's that's a very huge and I think that's very important. We are a team and we are a community um, and you know those voices need to be heard. So um, as I've reflected, I think the one word that I would choose for 2023 is collaboration. I think that goes a very far way um, and I think I also want to present all of you, um, not necessarily with the challenge, but to really open up and share your feedback and we want to hear your ideas too. You know, we are a community and the only way we're going to grow is if we're all in this together. So I would love to hear all of your feedback and everything that you have to suggest. You know, we will um, collaborate as a team and see how we can, again, move this needle and be, be um, the next big, or we are the big regional group. Um, so, um, now to end this, and I'm not gonna lie, I actually practiced this um, in my apartment alone. And um, I was sitting there and all of a sudden I like started getting really teary-eyed. I don't know why, I think I'm just like so excited. And also I meant to ask one of you to count how many times I say excited, because if I haven't said it already, I'm really, 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 really excited. Um, anyway, so I'm truly so honored and so excited to be standing here again and again to lead this organization in 2023. Um, truthfully, this or organization has helped me fall in love with this industry and the amazing people that it's made up of. Um, this is my true passion. I'm so happy to be part of something that's bigger than myself. I have never been so confident in something that, I, that I'm standing here promising you all to be such a great leader.